This place is paradise, man. What? Oh, no one told me they had these. I just found out that the beach on the other side of this bay is called Geode Beach because apparently it's literally covered with geodes. Hi, oh my gosh. <laughs> We're Mike and Taylor. And these are our dogs, Penny and Lucy. We sold our home and nearly all of our belongings, moved onto a 40 foot boat and sailed from Seattle. Embarking on the adventure of a lifetime. God. This is the story of us forging our own path, exploring the world in Via, figuring it all out as we go, and making our way. up anchor and uh, this pot of dolphins just surrounded us. It's crazy. We've seen them every day we've been here. They seem to come through this bay like two or three times a day. back south along the Baja Peninsula for one last trip to the city of La Paz before hurricane season keeps us tucked up far north in the Sea of Cortez through the summer. The space between Loreto and La Paz is wild, remote, and stunning. In fact, it's not uncommon to go days without seeing another boat in this stretch of water. Our next stop on the journey down is a visit back to one of our favorite islands we have ever been to. So we hoisted the sails and began in on a full day of travel, hoping to arrive before sundown. Before long, the perfect sailing breeze that was forecast had died to nothing. So we turned on the engine and relaxed as we sliced through the glassy waters. by boat. I mean they're just a few sort of like tents and sort of makeshift homes and uh, people live here like year round and they're like fishing villages and it's just insane. The, the backdrop is just wild and we're passing one of these little villages now. That's it right there. Luckily, as we headed into the San Jose Channel, 
Our wind finally filled in, so we raised sail for our final approach. today? Eight? I don't remember when we left home. Like 45 yeah. miles we did? Uh, nine hours and 14 minutes. We've done 48 miles. Oh, almost 50 miles we did today. That's a lot for yeah. a pretty slow boat. We are finally pulling into Isla San Francisco again. It was so beautiful last time we were there. Fingers crossed that we get some decent weather this round, but we've got a few days to spend here and uh, I'm really looking forward to it. So we are just pulling in, the sun is setting. It's been a nice little sail down this channel. And we've got two very hungry dogs. We're demanding their meal. And kind of a hungry husband who's also sort of demanding their meal. <laughs> and no fish! Not a one. We caught, we got one bite out there. Yeah, but whatever it was, I had some teeth. Probably can't see it so good, but. There's really like, there's like chunks out. taken out of this plastic thing. Look at that, like all over the back. This there's guy like looks a like puncture he wound right there. swallowed a shoehorn. Or <laughs> he's vomiting. gosh look at all these fish and we've got fish hunters in the bay Oh my god. <gasps> He's right here. Holy shit. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> oh my god, my should we jump in?
All the fish are hiding under our boat. Since there's dolphins in the bay. The dolphins are still over there, but I'm low-key getting ready to jump in the water if they come back around again. And they're kind of far away from us now. I don't really want to chase them, obviously. So I'm just kind of bopping around by Via, hanging out with my friends. I still see them over there though. They're right off the bow of the catamaran over there. Huh. <laughs> this catamaran just pulled into the bay and is is literally actually chasing them around the bay. That's a bummer. Man, we've seen a lot of dolphins the last week. They are out and about. Hunting and eating and playing and swimming. Greetings from Isla San Francisco, my favorite place on earth. This place just, ugh, this place just really is one of my favorite places I've ever been. I just am obsessed with every part of it. But anyway, we've been here for a few days. Yeah, no, let me say that slower because I didn't say words in there. We have been here for a few days and the few days that we've been here have been really windy. So we've just kind of been like hunkered down in the boat, doing work, like, not doing a whole much of anything. Um, but today the wind has stopped and it is warm and it is gorgeous and everything is perfect. And this morning there was a pot of dolphins in here swimming around our boat and it's just been beautiful. So we are now going on a little expedition because I found out, <clears throat> I didn't know this the last time we were here because we were here for Christmas. I just found out that the beach on the other side of this bay is called Geode Beach because apparently it's literally covered with geodes. These islands are volcanic. There's just like a whole bunch of cool shit happening over there. So Mike and I are gonna go on a little, gonna go on a little adventure time. We are gonna walk across the salt flats and go over to the other beach and we're gonna see if we can find ourselves some geodes today. There's something about the style of vegetation here that I just think is stunning. There's not a lot of vegetation. There's just got these like little shrubs, but they like they range from really bright yellow to bright green to these oranges and reds and these browns and grays and I just think they're so cool. And then set against these like red clay cliffs here and the white salt flats and the turquoise bay it's really something but like look at this he's got little buds on him yeah. these little mini wampin willows and then these like medusa cactus things 
Like, what is this? This is so cool. Oh my God. I've Ooh, never gnarly. seen one of those in real life. I just gotta give some perspective. Ah! Give me a stick. I don't got no stick. I need to poke it. Oh, I hate spiders. Oh man, he's just, he's too This is, up. what is this, this shit is this? It's the best I could do, this Mike. This is worthless. It's the desert, I don't know this what you want. This is a straw. Don't touch that spider. Look at those fangs. What? Oh, no one told me they had these. Oh. Yeah, there's a lot of shit on this side of the beach. Oh, I'm never sleeping on land. Dude. Look yeah, at those fangs. Look on these beaches. Ranchy. I hate spiders. Found a couple. Found a couple. Look at this one. Oh, we gotta hit that one with a hammer. Jackpot geo. Wow. They're just everywhere. Wow, Mike, this one is so good. Wow. Good work, Mike. Update from Geode Beach, we have found dozens on dozens on dozens of geodes and really cool rocks. And they're just everywhere. And East of San Francisco just continues to get cooler and cooler. It's pretty epic. Aside from the tarantulas. Oh yeah, I forgot about that guy. <laughs> Shabby for Rachel. This place is paradise, man. I could live out my whole life on this island. Yeah. And I would I would never tire of it. Oh. Next time on Sailing Via, we make one more stop before pulling into the city of La Paz, and it's a stunner. Join us as we swim, explore, and hike to stellar views on Isla Espiritu Santo. La 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 Ooh.